Taliote champs, hope you're all doing well out there. Today we're going to look at Dell's Inspiron 13 730621 home sort of slash office sort of laptop you can use for business, home, whatever. And actually they've got up to 40% off this thing, which is just like a crazy bargain. I'll leave a link in the description to the latest prices. But um, let's have a look at it. You can see here it's packaged in a nice plain box there. I like how they're really eco-friendly with their packaging. And if we have a look on the side there, we can see the specs of it. Yes, it comes with the latest Intel 11th generation CPUs. This one here comes with 16 gigabytes. It's LPDDR4X, which is awesome. Four 1267 megahertz so that's super fast ram there intel xe graphics of course that's what you get with 11th generation this one does have a 4k display so woof it is evo certified as well so as good as you can get in the intel world we'll open up this box and as you can see here we get a white box with a pen now one thing i want to point out is i have the black model now there's two versions of this 7306 2 and one there's a silver version and a black version the black version is the new premium version the black one is all you USB-C charging you need the barrel charger for the silver model you are also able to dock your pen with the black model I'll show you that later but it fits into the body of the laptop itself but here you can see the pen and because we're using the black model you know no batteries no messing about you just you know connect it to your laptop dock it it charges and use it whenever you want you can stick it in the body of the laptop and if you never use it you wouldn't even know you had it you're not going to lose it because you have that dock there we do have a 65 watt charger and this is usb-c as i said before the silver model is a barrel charger so it's not usb-c charging that's what i like about this one here and now we have the unit itself let's have a look at this here i got to say, with these Inspiron laptops that I have been reviewing lately, the build quality is really nice. And you can see this nice dark finish on it, premium metal build. If you think about the XPS series, the CNC machine, like, you know, ultra premium, it's not that level, but it's really not that far from, you know, XPS level. The build quality is like top draw, like it is really good. And of course, it's a 2-in-1, 16 by 9 display. And of course it's touch you do have the option of full hd and a 4k display i do have the 4k display which is 100 percent srgb 300 nits of brightness now as i said it is evo certified so that's going to be very interesting evo certified means it has to meet a certain criteria you know the way it can resume the battery life is supposed to be nine hours am i going to get nine hours on this considering it's 4k Ooh, we we'll have to wait and see it does have a 60 watt hour battery in there and the good thing is, now that I've actually unpacked it and I've started downloading stuff, it does need a BIOS upgrade. So you should do your BIOS upgrade. Make sure you always do that. I haven't heard the fans yet. Yeah, I can't really hear the fan in this so far just from downloading, which you usually do. This does have Wi-Fi 6 as well. So that is awesome. Everything you want. And at that 40% off, wow, that is just nuts. Now I'm going to do some testing with this. I'm going to whack two eGPUs on. Yes, two because this does have Thunderbolt 4. So make sure you subscribe for that video. We also get on the left hand side HDMI 2.0 with the Thunderbolt 4 as I said. On the right hand side USB Type-A 3.2 Gen 1. You have the combination audio jack and the micro SD card. Now if you get the silver model you're going to have the barrel charger there as well. You can still charge USB-C with the silver model but it's not going to be full power. You can't fully power it with that USB-C. And sometimes you come with a weight penalty with two in ones. This one no way. 2.81 pounds. Now the benchmarks for sort of ultra books or you know two and ones was around that sort of three pound mark. This is 2.8, so that's really good. 1.274 kilos and around 16 millimeters at its you know thickest point there. Now because this is a business laptop, you do get the privacy shutter for your webcam and you also get the fingerprint reader. That's sort of like a business thing. It is made for home and office, but consumers, man. When you can pick this up at a discounted price like you can at the moment, wow. Home office, just normal consumers, you're going to see it with two eGPUs on it. The stuff you can do with this thing and the price you can get it at at the moment. And the screen looks good as well. You know, I've just got to check out the thermals, battery life, etc. But it's looking like a really good laptop at a nice price. So... That is pretty cool. Of course, you can get the i5, i7, so the 1135 G7 and the 1165 G7. Now, if you get the i5, you usually only get 8 gigs of RAM, but you do get the good graphics with the i5, which is really good. So, so far, I'm liking this thing. Any tests you want done, let me know down there in the comments. The review will be coming soon. I can't wait to whack a couple of eGPUs onto this thing and see how it can boogie. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you in the next one. Tally ho.